Hello Diamonds and welcome back to Echo B Season 6. So in the uh, meantime I was able to upgrade my house. I did make a little fake chimney because on the brick part we don't have the exact piece. I think it was in the reinforced concrete that had the chimney parts that look a bit more realistic but well it's the best I can do. And I extended the building as well because I wanted to have more stuff inside so it's all brick so i'm trying to make money and then buying all the necessary things so i have now three cast iron stoves which is quite few and yeah i'm often running out of some stuff so need to go grind a little bit on those as well here i'm also making a lot of meat stock which is very important when I want to make uh, chuck fillet soups. I can put on this one the rest of the chuck fillet soups because I do have few shocks available. So, so I'll set up like twenty. Not sure if I will even do them. But no, at least ready. And yeah, <laughs> at the moment I have eighteen stock. I do like them. It's interesting, someone is doing them for very cheap price. So I think the meat stock is the most demanding place or element of that. So how much does the meat stock need? We need five scrap meats. Of course scrap meat is 0 0.1, so yeah, half. Depending on the shark prices and the shark price is normally around two pounds so that's why i'm selling still at four it's more like profits even though i'm going and getting myself then what else did i do is i moved all the uh, all the chests downstairs i have a little bit of rubbish here but i will clear it out so i only have one storage chest still upstairs but the rest is down here so it's more like the storage room so hopefully in the future i can put like refrigerators and stuff like that here so i can keep the foods nice and nice and fresh so i might need to also extend it out to make other storage here i made long ladder for that i added this column so it looks a bit more logical then I added this parking space. So this one will be used later on when I uh, also make the building. And about the residential building. So I marked down the area where it should go. So it's quite big. But yeah, it's, it's one of the projects that I have planned, but not sure when I can do it. Because, well, I need to grind quite a bit before I can make enough money as at the moment I only have like 130 bits which is not even close to enough to do anything and I also know that the uh, gardening part of the B project is uh, going on so Leo is put in charge and they are buying like a lot of different seeds and stuff different bricks some granite uh, like mortared granite, mortared limestone blue glass green glass and then a lot of seeds so i have to see if i can do anything and yeah someone is using very interesting store naming pretty much matching what i normally have it's i'm not sure if it's disturbing or not but well there's only one original one and yeah this season i'm using the wood mentioning on it as that's what i do maybe next season we will go back to the normal one it's the plan for the next season is probably try some other things like i was thinking trying more pottery and uh, masonry but yeah it depends for this season I also need to find out where I can make uh, 
the good uh, like farm area there's there's not really that much area available this jungle here is pretty much occupied already unless of course we go like in this corner here we have plenty of space this is the jungle we can grow certain uh, fruits and veggie I think main thing that I want from the jungle is the pineapple and I would also need to get some fern growing somewhere so yeah, I will quickly plan uh, areas for where we can grow stuff and then we can maybe set up our farms quickly. So I figured out that the best area would be about here. So we can have two different biomes next to each other. One is for fern and the other one is for the... Uh, what was it called? Uh, uh, fireweed. So this one is good for like many basic salads. So I do have few seeds playing around. But we do need some more burn around as well. So I might need to deal with that. So let's quickly claim a little bit land. But take one piece is this. And then it's easier for me to manage from yeah so and take like this we have a bit of space here I, I will leave some areas for like the regular growing so i'm not really doing everything manually but yeah the main thing is that i just want to make sure that i can um, have at least a few of those. Uh, I have quite a few seeds on that side, so not really worry. Let's see what we can nicely plant. And yeah, once we have advanced smelting and all this running, then hopefully we can also uh, get uh, started with the want to say with the greenhouse glass this is probably the best way to uh, to grow many crops in one place so then i will try to focus on the growing uh, near our place so the area where i have like the parking and currently some stockpiles that's what i want to turn into greenhouse possibly so yeah, we have the water nearby, so it'd be kind of okay. Of course, we will need some electricity as well, but it's kind of like secondary thing. Yeah, this is in. Okay, it goes all the way to the edge. That's excellent. So yeah, so once we have greenhouse, then we don't need to go around too much I also I'm thinking that in such case I might uh, maybe pick up farming so then it's a bit more use for everything so I also want to get the tractor and stuff like that it seems to be a little bit difficult with the current financial situation but well we'll see what we can do Maybe we have to borrow the machinery at the beginning or make the projects in a different way. Request the government. <laughs> I mean, I don't really want to request government for something that is so basic. I mean, I know Ragavan did one of the season, like big farming area, which was the public one. Maybe we can do exactly the same. It's kind of a possibility. I might need to talk to other people and see if if there's any meaning to do it this way. But well, at least we have so, some of our plants growing. I will, just in case, change the name to something easy. 
So let's put 077 F. It's a little bit annoying to sometimes write this. So this way at least we know what is the purpose of the lens. It's always good to name stuff, including like stockpiles and maybe even like some of your uh, work tables. Like for example, I think that like as I'm extending my house, I think I should, I haven't done it so, so far, but I should probably also name all my campfires so I know like which ones to take off from the auto feeder and so on because I, I do have the fuel loading enabled so all the coal that I have goes directly into the into the campfires and uh, cast iron stoves okay we put that oh, there's already some bricks available for Leo to work with nice quite few stockpiles for rests so Leo is the only one uh, from regular people who can access this land so yeah it's kind of nice and yes so the other place where I want to do the pineapples let me quickly get the stuff ready so we need pineapple seeds we have quite few Nice. We might have more somber. Sometimes the seeds go to different stockpiles, so it might get lost. It seems to be all. Ah. And also, I can give the try to the autumn stew. Mm. Kind of mediocre. I did quickly set up the bacon. We don't like bacon. It's the total opposite of real life. I think it's one of the best things. And we do have some foods that are kind of close to expiring. So like 7% left. So those I will probably consume by myself. So just it's not being wasted. But yeah, let's quickly go over to the area that I thought is good for pineapples. Takes quite a while with this old vehicle. But at least I don't need to walk all the distance. So yeah, the roads are getting much nicer. Once we have asphalt roads, then of course it gets even better. And yeah, in many places it's full width, which is the 15 blocks. So a lot of work for people who will upgrade it from from stone road to asphalt but it's not too bad and yeah in jungle it's very difficult to find land as I mentioned before I mean Dan has quite a lot of space taken and yeah he's doing some type of inn as well so this season everyone wants to make buildings I maybe maybe I should have taken like papayas as well. This pineapple isn't the only one. I'll quickly go down. I think around this corner is good because there's like no one else. So just to make sure that uh, it's not part of the district. Yeah, road district doesn't come here, which is good. We can easily claim like few plots in these neighborhoods and make our little farm. I mean, that's part of the road, so I will try to avoid. And now, interesting name again. <laughs> So, I might do like this way. Six claims. And new name.
maybe I should start uh, copy pasting stuff. It would be a lot easier. But yeah, it's good. And it's also a good area for the bullet mushrooms. There's some recipes require those as well. And yeah, we do have a few trees. So I want to keep the trees as they are. So we have to just go a little bit around. But there is the pineapples is plant once and harvest as many times as you can. It's always a good thing. But yeah, this is kind of the edge, so I will leave it empty in case we want to extend the road a bit. Let's see. One we can't. Get this broke. I have a few redstones for that. We need more seeds now. So it's definitely not enough. I would like at least three more. We have any pineapples laying around that we can harvest. Any of this extra seeds this one is not ready why do people leave all the rubbish everywhere not nice actually one of the things that has been causing a lot of uh, lag in the past few days is like mainly loose rocks it seems I know that Moss was checking earlier today and then came back with the information that that might be the reason but once we have skids and stuff like that then i feel that it will be much easier because with the skids uh, you don't really leave loose rocks anymore but still like the updates on the on the digging it will be significant still no seeds See, I always like when you need seeds, you never get them. And if you don't need them, then you will get plenty. Oh, I think I have to do that then off the camera because otherwise it will get super boring. But yeah, so hopefully next time we can also set up our building. I mean, for the housing, at least get the foundation done. So today we only have the four corner blocks. But yeah, just to get like some type of housing on the top. And I'm also think thinking that maybe I have to make some type of pier or something downstairs. Maybe even pool area if I'm good enough with the design. So yeah. So hopefully next episode we can work on that side and yeah then the greenhouse should be about here so maybe it goes all the way to this building and then on the edge of the parking because i can easily move the parking all to be part of the shop or even different claim maybe different claim is better so yeah i will take all this area out of those two claims and make it the greenhouse but yeah but anyway thank you for joining me today and i will see you next time